Good morning and welcome to Going to Work with Gina, which is an infomercial for STEM students. I am Dr. Gina Henderson. STEM students, this morning I want to talk about the value of integrity. The value of integrity. Inter integrity is that trustworthiness and honesty that you put into whatever you do. Um, it has a physical aspect about it, an intellectual aspect about it, and an ethical aspect about it. So let's say, for instance, let's use some real life examples here. So let's say, for instance, um, when you go to school every morning, your parents are expecting you to physically show up in school. They are expecting you to perform intellectually when you're in school. And they are expecting you to have ethical or moral values while you are in school. There are certain th rules, standards, and laws that keep you inside those boundaries in school. Okay, same thing when you go off to college. When you go off to college, you know, college is something that you pay for. So the professors are not going to spoon feed you everything. When there's issues and things that need to be resolved, you need to be a go-getter and go and get those things. So parents are expecting you when they give you the money to pay the fees. Okay, they're expecting you to physically be in school at that university. They're expecting you to um, intellectually perform in the classroom because they're expecting you to walk away with an expertise later on that's going to help you get a job. And then they're expecting you to have those ethical morals while you're there to serve within those boundaries to make sure that you get that degree. And the reason I'm going into all of this is because once you um, gain the knowledge that you gain, one day you will be an expert. And in your expertise, there you will work for an organization and they will trust you and the knowledge that you have and the expertise you have gained based on um, your field of study. So there are some organizations that you're going to work for that require national sovereignty. And so those are the federal agencies where like myself, where um, we are civil servants. So as a civil servant, you um, are expected to perform in boundaries to where the public um, um, really pay taxes for you to be there. So your value is expected to be truthful. You are expected to always be honest. So there's an integrity of an organization um, that goes forward to make sure that we remain um, safe. So let's think about what's going on um, with the recent hurricanes. And um, NOAA and um, NWS, all of that AMS, all of, all of that that's going on right now is because you have to be able to trust people in power who say um, um, a storm is coming and you need to prepare yourself this way. These people are trained experts. What this put me in remind of when I was in grade school was the story of Chicken Little. I don't know if you guys remember about Chicken Little, but Chicken Little ran outside every day and told his friends and everybody, the sky is falling, the sky is falling, the sky is falling. So he did this so many times that when it actually was time and there was something actually going on with him where the sky was falling, no one believed him. No one believed him because his integrity was shot. Okay, so if you want to keep your integrity in intact, you want to make sure that you are doing what you say you are doing. You are where physically you're supposed to be. And intellectually, you are doing things. You are a thinker. You are going to take this nation to the next level. Okay, so I want to thank you for going to work with Gina this morning. If there's any infomercials that you've missed, please don't hesitate to go to YouTube, going to work with Gina. Thank you.